es bambinita. Bambini, bambini. I'm a little chora, it's bambini. Come let's learn in various fun way. It's an educational TV show. My name is Kezia the Poet and today I'm here at Tema Community 12 SDA Church and they are having vacation Bible school. They are going to be doing so many fun activities like cooking, sewing, they are going to learn Bible lessons and they are going to have lots of fun. So follow me as we go. Happy! Our lesson today is about, I'm sorry, the prodigal son. And we all know that the prodigal son is a parable. One of the parables Jesus told the people when he came. So what does the topic talk about? What is the topic teaching us? God is ever ready to forgive us. Amen? Amen. So whenever you sin against God, Please, don't stay there. Come to him and ask God that, God, I'm what? I'm sorry. And let the story come from what? Your heart. But when you genuinely go to your friend, I'm sorry, the person will do what? Forgive you. And then one day, this guy decided that, no, I cannot continue like this. I want to go back to my father. Amen? Amen. So when he started the journey, early in the morning, he was afraid. Maybe the father would say that, I will not take you, go back. But when the father saw that Kojo was coming, the father was running, running. And the boy too was running. And hugged his father and knelt down and said, Daddy, oops, Daddy, I'm sorry. What do we learn from the story? We learn to forgive, okay? We learn to what? The father forgave the younger son. Even though he went to spend all the money and the food he was given. But when he came back home, he did what? He forgave him. He did what? He Okay, so today, you should know that when someone does something to us, we have to do what? We have to do what? Happy! Yay! Hi, guys. Hello. Hi. What are your names? Augustina and Gifty Araba. Okay. Did you enjoy today's program? Yes. Okay. I want you to make a game from today's lesson. Can you do it? Yes, please. Okay. I'm waiting for you. <laughs> the funny girl son is coming. Yeah, that's the game. Okay. So, what does it mean? Like, since the prodigal son was coming, his, the people from his father's place were happy to see him. It's not mobile amp, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, thanks for coming on the show. Say bye-bye. Bye. Hello. Hello. What's your name? Bright. And? Evans. Okay, what did you learn at today's program? Oh, we learned about the prodigal son. Can you tell me a little bit about the prodigal son? Oh, the prodigal son took a share from his dad and he left away. And later on came to his dad and the dad hugged him for him being alone. So he stayed at the place over years without returning back home. And after he came back, the dad celebrated the party, organized the party in the same area where he lived. So they all had fun of seeing his son back. Okay, nice. Can you tell me some morals from the story? Okay, we learned that we should wait for God's promise. And we shouldn't be harsh. Like, what God prepares for us, we should wait for it. Okay. Nice having you. Let's say bye-bye to our fans. Bye-bye. So I have one beautiful family here, 
and they are going to be sharing with us their experience in the Adventist Church. What are your names? Um, Nina Ofoetongson, please. Okay, and you? Nora Nande Ofoetongson. Okay, what's your name? J.D. Ofoetongson. Okay, I'm going to be speaking to Albert mainly. So, Albert, who brought you to church exactly? Please, um, my brother, actually. She saw this church and she thought, she said it would be a nice place where we can really worship. So she sent me there and after one month, I told her about how the church is. And she also came there and when we went home, she also told me that it's very true that church is really a, a, a God's worship church. Okay, so your mother also came with you? Yes. And your whole family? So how has been? How has your experience been? Well, it's been great. Um, attending the Seventh Adventist Church made me know many things about God, and I would like to thank them very much. Thank you. Okay. So did you all enjoy today's program? Yes. I can see you have some artwork here. Show it to the camera. Okay, that's nice. Which class is that? Painting. The painting class. Yeah. Okay, let's say bye-bye. What's your name? My name is Brian. Okay, is today your first experience? Is it your first time being at um, VBS? No. You've been here before? Yes. When? Last year. Last year. Was it fun? Yeah. Okay, are you enjoying today's program? Yes. What have you learned so far? I learned about the prodigal son. It was about a boy. He took all his money from his father and soon went to spend it with his friends. When the money got finished, he had no job but to feed the pigs. So one day he decided to go to his father. When he went home, his father was happy, but his elder brother was not happy with the decision his father made. Oh. Thank you. Oh, nice, nice, nice. What's your idea, pal? Okay, let's say bye-bye to our mini fans. Bye-bye. Okay, so I have some beautiful ladies here. What are your names? Naomi Owusu. And? Doris Kessel. Okay. Did you enjoy today's program? Yes, of course. Okay. So I want one of you to summarize today's lesson for me. Okay. Um, today was a very wonderful day and we learned about the prodigal son. Um, it was about a very wealthy man who had two sons and the younger one decided to take his inheritance from his dad. So um, <clears throat> he set out to have fun with his bad friends. And unfortunately, he lost all his money. Oh, okay. So who can make a song from today's lesson? Okay. Okay. okay we learned about prodigal song. So the, 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 the song is about prodigal. So prodigal. Prodigal. <laughs> prodigal. 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 Okay, nice having you. Let's say bye-bye to our Bambini fans. Bye-bye. class and auntie is here to tell us what's going on. Hello. Hi. Please introduce yourself. Okay. My name is Christy and today I took the cooking class. Basically, we learned how to make pancakes. So the two types of pancakes, the English pancake and the American type pancake. So we went through the ingredients, what we need, which are basically the flour, sugar, eggs, milk, some vanilla extract, salt, to taste and that is what we, we learned and the actual recipe to get the various types of pancakes that's the english and the american pancake yes okay thank you it was nice having you all right thank you too Happy! So I'm here at the Arts and Crafts Classroom and I can see they are doing a lot of beautiful artworks. I'm going to be speaking to this beautiful lady sitting down. Hi, Auntie. Hi, my name is Mavis Comson. Today we are doing uh, cut and paste. So first, this is our template. That, this is our template that when you, you have to color. After coloring, you are going to cut. Then we are going to come out with a beautiful 
artwork like this. So it is about three minutes work. Color, color, cut, then paste. That is it. Yes. Color, cut, and paste. So this is from ages between six to eight. Yes. Okay, nice having you. Thank you. Okay, bye bye. Happy! So I'm here at the Fascinator class, and this beautiful lady is going to be introducing herself. Hello. Hi. I'm Rebecca Nyamedo. Okay. Are you the teacher for this class? Yes. Okay. So what exactly are you doing today? So as you can see, we are learning Fascinator. Yes, the basic one for today. And these are some. Okay. Can you show us some of the steps? Okay. Actually, you need um, your crinoline. So the first step is that you should be able to tie the crinoline to prevent it from um, falling or spoiling. Uh -huh. Or you use your B6000 or B7000 to hold it from spoiling. Then after that, you try and coil it into the shape you want. So in a shape, for this class, every mistake is a new style. So as you can see, some of them are having different shapes. Uh, so after that... Then you fix your hairband and other stuff on it. That's all. Okay, it was nice having you. Thank you. Nice having you. Happy! Yay! So I have with me here three beautiful women who helped organize this program. Please introduce yourselves. I'm Mrs. Monica Johnson, Community 12 SDA Church, Children Ministries Local Leader. Mrs. Dina Bochi. I'm the district leader for the Temanov district. Okay, my name Thank is you. Mrs. Henrietta Jongfu Akuma, the conference director for this conference. Yeah. Thank you. Auntie, please, can you tell us the purpose of today's program? Yeah, the purpose of today's program is to bring all children to, in the district together and also reach out to the children in the community. Auntie Hetty, please, what does today's program really mean to you? All right, as you know, we do evangelism a lot. And our purpose for children's ministry is child evangelism. Fortunately, today when we came, we have almost 20 non-Adventist children who are here with us. So I'm happy that our purpose is being achieved. Okay. Auntie, please, do you have any message for children and parents who haven't yet graced the occasion? Yes. To start with, I would say I'm so proud that this program is being hosted by my church. We have the facilities to host this program. And what I'll tell my parents out there and the kids who are not yet here, that they are missing so much. We've learned a lot. We had our Bible lessons. We have our craft work. And you could see every child here is fully participating. And they are all happy. We have not yet concluded. Tomorrow and Sunday will be here. So we pray that every parent will bring their children here for them also to take part in this very important program. Okay, thank you all. It was nice having you. Let's say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. Hi friends, I'm Gifty, a little from Temano District, come to Seoul. Today is the vacation Bible school day, the second day, and today is the graduation day. I'd like us to go in there to witness them graduate. Happy!
vacation bible school the graduation is it true yeah so you were graduated right yes oh okay so what do you guys learn we learned a lot of things how to about the parable of the jesus christ what he said to the people and some of the parable like the parable of the prodigal son oh, okay so do you guys do activities yes activities such as fascinators so yeah Crafts making, etc. Really? So you know how to do crafts? Yeah. Oh, okay. So what do you say to your bambini friends? They should join the VBS class. It will help them to learn a lot of things that will help them in the future. Oh, okay. So say bye bye to your bambini friends. Bye. -bye. bye. Hello, I'm Gifty and you, Evans. You are looking gentle. Wow. Were you part of the, those who graduated today? Yes. How was it? Yeah, it was nice. Oh, really? So what did you guys learn? Learned about the power of Jesus. Oh, okay. And then, which activities do you take part in? Cooking. Oh, cooking. So you know how to cook. Yes. Oh, okay. So then, what do you tell your vacation by uh, your bambini friend? Mm, they should watch uh, Bambili show and they should register for next year vacation Bible school. Oh, okay. So let's say bye bye to the uh, bambini. And this is Elaine Sheila. So today we are here at Tema Community 12 SDA Church, and this is the last day of Vacation Bible School. So they are having some fun sporting activities. Elaine, which sporting activities are they having? Football, lime spoon, face painting, and a lot more. We are having a, we are having fun. Okay. So sit down, relax, and enjoy watching us play. Elaine, Elaine, get the ball. of this game is to promote and foster teamwork. If we are together, we always have to work together. If everybody does what he wants to do, we can achieve success and synergy. Is that okay? Yes! Yeah. 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 Go, 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 go
battle with the girls. It's between Saki, that's Asantoa, and Joyce Lane from Gulf City. This is where we get to know who is the best. So at this time, they are ready. Red, gold, green. Asantua from Saki Church. My Lord is coming again. Happy! Yay! The final round for the boys. And the guy in red is from Saki. It's called Ronald. And this is Ni from Gulf City Church. All right, Nana from Gulf City Church. So they are ready to go. So red, yellow, green. Once again, the winner goes to Saki SDA Church. At this time, we are waiting for the next game. That is Lime and Spoon. Happy! the final and we have Michelle Camp versus Saki. Michelle Camp versus Saki. Females, are you ready? Red, yellow, green, start. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, Wonder Woman, 18, 19, 20, Wonder Woman, 21, 22, 21, okay, go, 21, 0, let's go. 21 0, 21 1, 21 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 
44, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 50, 55, 55, 55, 21. Last round, last round, go. 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 41, 50, last round, not needed. 56, 56, okay, that's good. So a winner for this round goes to Saki. the champions for the bottle flip competition. Everybody say yay! yay. So what's your name? My name is Dorothy Suka. Okay, what's your name? Doris Ankama. Okay, how is the feeling like? How does it feel to win a bottle flip competition? Because me, I know I can't do it. It's very interesting. It's very interesting. Okay, so what did you get? 58. You got 58 points. Okay, how about you? I felt very happy about getting 48. Oh, okay, nice. Okay, let's say bye-bye to my mini fans. Bye-bye. Okay, I have two beautiful princesses here. Your name? Abena. And yours? Kriya. So, how do you feel about the activities you had today? Fun. How about you? Happy. Oh, that's nice. So, what activity did you take part today? Passing the balloon. Oh, how about you? Passing the balloon. Oh, interesting. Were you guys in the same team? Yes. Oh, that's nice. So I hope I see you next year. Bye. I'm Aunt Dina, the district coordinator for Temanov District. We organized this vacation Bible school to help our children to learn about kindness, obedience, and how to say I'm sorry. We taught them all these things so that it will help our children to learn. And then they will practice it in their lives and they will grow and become more like Jesus. We had some non-Adventist um, children from our vicinity, and we were happy to see them. They were very happy, and we know that they will also use it in their lives. I want to say a big thank you to Pastor Bule, our district elders, and then our host church, Community 12 Elders, for hosting us this year's Vacation Bible School. We also thank our sponsors. A lot of parents sponsored our program. We say a big thank you to you all. And my teachers, you also help our kids in their various activities. We say thank you, and may God bless you. Before I end, I want to say a big thank you to Pastor Bule, our district elders, and then our host church, come to 12 elders. And not forgetting Durama ice cream for refreshing us with your delicious ice cream. We say thank you, and may God bless you. Oh, it's time to go, I